Mr. Fisher, good to see you again. Rod Green, marketing. Uh, you must be... Leaving. In case you get bored. I think you just got blown off. Unless your phone number really does only have six digits. Strange way to make friends. Just in your wallet, I mean. God damn it, that wallet's alone's worth 500 500 bucks, I know. Don't worry. My guys are on it. Who did you say you were? I said I was Rod Green from marketing. But I'm not. My name is Mr. Charles. That might seem familiar to you. I'm in charge of your security here. Security? You work with the hotel. Oh. My specialty is subconscious security. You're talking about dreams. You're talking about extractions. Exactly. My job is to protect you from any attempt to access your mind through your dreams. You're not safe here. Trust me, they're coming for you. Very odd, the weather, the change in gravity. But I can explain all this. You've actually been trained for this. Think of the strangeness of the weather, the shifts in gravity. None of this is real. We are in a dream. So, you, you're not real? No. I'm a projection of your subconscious. I was put into place to protect you in the event that extractors pulled you into a dream. I believe that's what has happened. I'm gonna help you, I need you to remain calm. What do you remember from before this dream? Rain. Gunfire. Peter. Christ, we've been kidnapped. Where are they holding you? They had us in the back of the van. It's, it's to do with a, a safe. Christ, why is it so hard to remember? It's like trying to remember a dream after you've woken up. You and Browning have been pulled into this dream so they can steal something from your mind. What? Um, they wanted the combination to a safe. They demanded the first numbers to pop in my head. That's them extracting a locator. Uh, a number from your own subconscious. It can be used in a number of ways. This is a hotel. Room numbers. What was the number they gave you? 52-something. It was a long number. 5284-something. Five, five, well, we know where to start. Fifth floor. 